Over the next minute, I will discuss the retentive component of a removable appliance called Adams clasp, first described by Professor Philip Adams in 1948. Also known as the Liverpool clasp, universal clasp, and modified arrowhead clasp. The clasp is constructed using 0.7 mm hard round stainless steel wire. It can be used for both deciduous and permanent teeth as well as on partially and fully erupted tooth. It can be used on molars, premolars and incisors. Modifications of Adams clasp. Adams clasp with single arrowhead, half Adams clasp. This type is indicated in the partially erupted tooth, which usually is the last erupted molar. The single arrowhead is made to engage the mesioproximal undercut of the last erupted molar. The bridge is modified to encircle the tooth distally and ends on the palatal aspect as a retentive arm. Adams clasp with J-hook. This hook is used for engaging elastics. Adams with incorporated helix. It is also used for engaging elastics. Adams with additional arrowhead. This type of clasp is used when additional retention is required. Adams with soldered buckle tube. This modification is used with facebo headgear assembly. Adams with distal extension. This modification helps in engaging elastics. Adams on incisors. This type of clasp is used when additional retention is required. It can be also used in premolars. Assalamu alaikum. Thank you very much. Please share and subscribe.